guys and welcome to part 21 of the Sims 4 Big Sister Challenge. So in the last part we kind of got a little more reacquainted with our girls and I had asked you guys how you felt if we were to move to the big old city of San Maishu now and I was surprised that almost everyone had said that we should go ahead and kind of pack everything up that we have and move over to the city. It would be a fresh start for the girls and it's kind of something that I feel like would be a lot of fun to do and I know that there were a couple I guess suggestions to stay where we are mainly because of course a lot of people are moving over to San Maishu now but I just want to kind of let you guys know that we might be we are moving to the city that's happening in this part but it's not going to be strictly just about San Maishu no it's still going to be focused on the girls themselves of course we're going to hang out in the city but we're not going to be mainly focused on the world of San Maishu no and city living of course I have a whole separate LP of that but um I feel like it'd be a really really good move for these guys and uh, Honestly, we could probably get a much, much nicer apartment than this little house that we have. Don't get me wrong. I think this house is adorable, but I feel like it's 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 kind of time to uh, kind of time to move things along. So with that said, I had Avery do a little bit of painting to make us a little money. We're almost to 8,000 simoleons. I think we have enough money to get an apartment, I think. So what I did is I took some of the more important stuff, like the pictures on the wall. I took all the plants because obviously the plants make us a, a lot of money. And I had Avery go along and kind of harvest everything really, really quickly. So I'm just going to be selling some of this stuff so we can get some money. And then as soon as that is done, we are going to kind of sell everything and move over to the big city. So I am really, really excited to get this move going and... I actually have an idea of which apartment I want to get for these guys, but I'm not 100% sure how much money it is that we actually have, so that's why I was holding off on doing that. So we are at 8,500, 8, almost 8,600 simoleons, and then the I think the worth of the house is like 16-ish thousand, so we have quite a bit to work with. So <clears throat> we are going to go in here and move the household. Oh, I'm so excited. And I changed their phone covers because I completely forgot that was even a thing. So she has a pink one. I want to say Aspen's is green or yellow. I can't remember. It's either green or yellow, but it has like stripes and it's really, really freaking cute. And oh my gosh, I'm so excited to do this. And I'm so happy that you guys are excited about me bringing the series back. I know a lot of you guys lo loved these girls and were really, really happy that I brought it back. So I'm really, really thankful for you guys and all the amazing support on uh, kind of putting this on hold, taking a step back and then bringing it back. And I'm, I'm really happy. Okay. So it looks like we have a little under 18,000 simoleons, which is pretty much what I thought we were going to have. So let's go ahead and head over to send my Shuno. I was thinking I really want them to either live in the fashion district or the arts quarter, uh, mainly because I feel like that's more of their vibe. I don't really see them living in the spice market. It is the cheaper area, of course, but I don't know. I don't really, I don't really see that as being theirs. And obviously we can't afford uptown because, you know, the struggle is real and all that. So I think there's one that we can afford in here. So we can afford, oh my gosh, weekly rent 17,545. Jeez. I don't know if we can afford this one. Let's see. What's the one we can afford over here? So there's this one, which is kind of more of the crappier one. And then there's this one, which actually is pretty decent. Only thing is that it has lively neighbors, which kind of sucks. But I don't know. Let's see. If we were to get this one... It has gnomes and penny pixies, which is which are actually great lot traits to have, to be honest. Um, oh, we can actually afford it. <gasps> Guys, I didn't think we could afford this one. Is it bad that I kind of want it? Guys, I, I think I think we found our home. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. I haven't seen this apartment. Wow, this place is huge. Wow. This is a lot bigger than I thought it was. Oh my gosh, how cute. It's like a little, kind of like a closet. I could probably put an actual closet in there, to be honest. This is so cute. Oh, it's three bedrooms. So we kind of have a, I guess, quote unquote office that we can use. Aspen gets a huge room. Avery gets an even huger room. Oh my gosh. I am so excited about this. I kind of like the yellow vibe. Is that weird? I don't know. I kind of like it. 
We have a, actually, we actually have a dining room now and a kitchen. Oh my gosh. We have a living room. Oh my gosh. We definitely moved up. That's for sure. I am so excited about this. Oh my goodness. So looks like there are two other people that live in here. This is a really small apartment over here. So it looks like, is this our mailbox? That's our mailbox. Okay. Ooh, let's leave a note. Why not? I mean, we just moved in. That's the least we could do. Oh, that's so cool. You can actually see it. Wow. I didn't know you could do that. Can't read it for crap because, you know, simlish and all that. This is unbelievable. Wow. Anyway, I'm not 100% sure if I want to decorate on camera or off camera. I think I'll leave that up to you guys. Obviously, we don't have a whole lot of money, but we can sell a lot of this stuff we don't need. Ooh, we even have a computer. Wow, this is this is a great place. Um, so yeah, I'll leave it up to you guys. If you want me to decorate on camera, I can totally do that. If not, I can do it off camera and kind of just continue on with things. I might have her paint a little bit so that we can make a little bit more money before going in and redecorating. Or we can just kind of redecorate as we get the money and things like that. I'm totally fine with. So yeah, I'll leave that up to you guys if you want me to do that. So wow, I'm, I'm so excited about this. Oh my gosh, this is so much nicer than I was expecting. I was expecting us to have kind of one of the crappier ones, but... These girls definitely worked hard to get some money, that's for sure. So it is a Saturday morning, and the girls are feeling pretty, pretty great. Luckily, I don't know why they woke up at like four in the morning. I, I don't know. They both woke up at like four or five in the morning, and we're just kind of chilling. So yeah, I don't, I don't know what, what's up with their sleeping schedules. Have you done your homework already, honey bun? Mm -mm, let's see. Oh, yay, the freezing. All right, go ahead and work on your homework while we have a little bit of time. And then what do you have in your inventory? We have to put our pictures back up. That's right. I'll have to do that. Is there anything kind of going on? Let me see. Where is the center? Oh, okay, it's over here. Don't look. Yeah, it doesn't look like anything's going on over here. Ooh. Oh, wow, look at all the paintings. Oh, my God, this one, though is um it's actually it's actually terrifying I'm not gonna lie i i kind of want to cry because that's terrifying Ooh, that one's really nice so is i'm assuming this is oh yeah okay so she's selling the paintings <gasps> we should totally do that with avery oh my gosh that's an awesome idea that we could do Ooh, the wow i said the welcome oh i can't speak the welcome wagon is here so hopefully we can meet our neighbors if anyone actually um, shows up. Oh, okay. So we have Sa Salim Benali. Let's go ahead and do a cheerful introduction to him. And for some reason, he's thinking about a little sister. So can you can you not though? That's a child trick now. Oh, Ashman. Wow, she finished her homework already. You go, little boo. <laughs> you go. I guess this is our only neighbor. I I don't know. Let's go ahead and thank him for coming. I definitely want to be, I guess, more on the good side of our neighbors. He seems pretty cool, though. I mean, I don't know too much about this sim. I know a lot of people have, like, have friendships with him in their Let's Plays of City Living and things, but I don't really know this dude. He's looking at us like we're crazy. He was like, who is this child? Oh, hello, lady. I'm assuming, are you our neighbor as well? Let's give you a cheerful introduction. Yeah, he does not look impressed with us. He's just like, why is this child here? Glad we got a chance to chat. Oh my gosh, there's more people. Hello, people. How are you? Oh my gosh, he brought us fruitcake. Just because you brought us fruitcake, I'm inviting you in because I, I want I want the fruitcake. I don't know if I've ever had a sim that actually liked the fruitcake, but Avery is more of our foodie anyway, so maybe she'll be into it. Who knows? I guess we'll have to find out. Do you want to come inside our amazingly amazing apartment? Because I know you're jealous because our apartment looks amazing. Are you, are you can I have the fruitcake? Please, please and thank you. Put it down, put it down. Put the fruitcake down. Thank you. We have fruitcake. And I've noticed that the fruitcake doesn't like ever go bad. Is, is that a real thing or is that a bug? Because whenever I have fruitcake in the game, it, it's just there forever. It never goes away. Lady, are you are you okay? 
Do you um? Do you need to go to the bathroom? I mean, and you're allowed to go inside my apartment. So, is he? F oh, are these guys together? Oh, okay. That's cute. They're a cute couple. That's awesome. I might add in some teenagers to maybe the other apartment that's not used, or I don't know. I'll figure something out. Or into the world of San Maishino in general. There's a couple of teenagers that come with the game, but I more or less want to add in some new peeps. So if you guys want well, to make me some Sims, <laughs> kind of with the city lip. Okay, guys. Um, okay. D uh, okay, whatever. Um, anyway, um, if you guys want to make me some Sims to use, you guys can use kind of the city living. Ex what? Invite to brainstorm. What does this mean? Sure, you can brainstorm with us, I guess. Um, if you guys want to make me some Sims using the City Living Expansion Pack and create some items, go ahead and do that. If you want to, um, go ahead and put them on the gallery with the hashtag. Um, probably I'll do Day Big Sis. So D A I B I G S I S. And I think we will do that. I'll leave it for like a week or so. That way you guys can make some Sims. I'll try to put them into the game or I guess into the role of Sam Maishino and do it that way. This guy is really, really nice. I don't know what it means by, like, brainstorm. I, I've never seen that. I don't really know what that means. Oh, we keep getting money. It's so awesome. With the penny pixies. I mean, it's not a lot. It's five simoleons, but I mean, it's five more simoleons than we had a little while ago. So go ahead and ask him about his career. Why don't you have a deep conversation? What are you up to, little munch? Oh, she's sitting at the little desk. I love this desk. Oh, my gosh. Oh, he's a writer. That's pretty cool. Oh, so happy. So why don't you invite over a friend? Let's see. Who should we... We can invite Max over. We haven't seen him in a little while. Go ahead and head... Not head over. Go ahead and invite him to head over. And then... Why don't you... Let's see. Where is Luna? So go ahead and invite Luna over. Oh my god, our relationship with Sean is so bad. I still can't believe that he's actually, yeah. like, here. At least I'm in the last part. That was crazy. Uh -huh. Ooh, we should get a gaming system. I don't know how much those are, though. That's the only thing. Your friend is here. Come invite your friend in. Give him an apartment key. You can give... Ch Wait, children can do that? Oh, good to know. Very, very good to know. Oh, we should give Luna a key. I think that'd be a great idea. I'm going to hold off on giving Max a key just for the time being because, I mean, they're just children. And I know, you know, it's the Sims and all that. But realistically, I don't think children should be allowed to do that. But Oh, wait. Did Luna say she was coming over? Yeah. She'll be here in a little bit. Uh-huh. Oh, my God. Max's voice? Why is that so deep? Oh, my God. They can become best friends forever. This needs to happen. Oh, she's talking about the move. Oh, no. What's wrong with you? What's wrong? Oh, what's the matter? Oh, we should give her a key, too. Give her apartment key. I don't know what's wrong with her. Why is she so sad? What happened? Oh, she's happy now. Oh, okay. <laughs> I guess she just needed to see her best friend. Fair enough. Oh, we gave her a key. Yay. Let's go ahead and show off our outfit, because we do have a new outfit. Oh my god, they're poking fun at each other. These guys are so cute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, let's enthuse about the outdoors. <clears throat> I am so excited about this. Oh my gosh. I just can't believe it how great of, a, of an apartment we were able to get. Oh, I totally forgot you were here, dude. Well, um, I guess you can just hang out. I don't know. Let's see, what else? Ooh, we should go down to the food trucks and get something to eat. I think that would be so yummy. And luckily, none of these guys are vegetarians, because I just, I'm awful at remembering that my Sims are vegetarians. And I make them eat all the nap. Ooh, we should do a mural. Ooh, who's this? Who are you? Are you a teen? Ricky Daly, Dally. Darnell C Cumins? C Cumins, I think. Oh, we actually know this guy. Oh. Alright, so why don't you come over here and continue this mural. 
Aspen, are you hungry? A little bit. So why don't you come over here? Hold on. We should actually go ahead and it'll be so much easier if we just make a group. Oh, where's Max? Max? Did you, um, did you ditch us? I have no clue where they, they went. Oh, okay. Here he is. Let's go ahead and make a group. Let's see. Actions. Form group. We'll do, there you go. That works. And then we can come over. Oh, I think I'm lost. I think I'm lost. Okay. Go here together. There. That is so much easier. How cool. Oh. What is this? A nature mural? I think it's... Yeah, it's a nature mural. That looks really cool, though. I would love to get Avery into kind of like graffiti and doing murals everywhere. We could probably even do one in our apartment, which would be really, really cool. So I'm just going to speed this up so that they get here. Perfect. And let's see what kind of food stands we have. Oh, awkward. We're so lucky to have such great neighbors like you. Yes, you are, though. We're fantabulous neighbors, and I swear if you make a lot of noise, I'm going to be very upset. I guess we just have to wait for that food stand to open or something. I'm sure it'll open soon. How cool is this mural though? I really want to see, I know these take forever and a day to kind of do, but I think it'd be really, really interesting to see what it might look like. I don't know, I guess we'll have to see. And, ooh, this lady is, oh look, there's some children. Oh my gosh, Aspen, meet some friends. Be social child. She looks, you know, ex so excited about life. Billy Jang. So why don't you go ahead and give her a friendly introduction? And who is this? Aya Mendir. You can go ahead and give her a friendly introduction as well. Meet some friends, child. Be social. Why is everyone so uncomfortable? Why is this a thing? Oh my gosh, guys. It is Bay. If you guys watch my City Living LP, you will know I am so obsessed with this guy. He is so cute. If you were a teenager, I would totally have my little Avery go after you, but... To be fair, you're a little bit too old for her, so we're just gonna ignore that, I guess. <laughs> oh my gosh, I apologize if I sound super stuffy, guys. I don't know, my allergies are being so bad today, and I'm so stuffy, and it's so annoying. Oh, she's so cute! I wish she- why is she so uncomfortable? Are you hungry or something? Oh, she's crying! Do not do this to me, child. You are so adorable. Okay, both of you are really that uncomfortable? I, I don't understand. What, okay, that lady totally just left. That was, um, awkward, I guess. So, at least we know these guys. They're super uncomfortable. Oh, no. Why is this guy being... Avery, are you seriously taking selfies while... Uh, I don't know. Dude, what is your issue? Why are you being so mean? Oh, he is mean. <laughs> I guess that would be why he's being so mean. Okay, can we, like, not talk to you? Because you're kind of a douche. So, yeah, thanks for that, I guess. Is the food stall open? It is! Alright, little one. Go ahead and order some food. Um, why don't you get a hot dog? That sounds pretty fun. Ooh, this mural looks so cool. Oh, that guy's leaving. Totally forgot you were at my apartment, but okay, bye, I guess. <laughs> you want to get to know your sister. Get creative, definitely, honey. Oh, wait, who's this guy? Who are you? Rudy Stout. You're an adult. You look like a teenager from, like, his body language, I guess. I don't know. Oh, how much longer until... Oh my gosh, you still have 24 days until you age up. That is like forever. I was thinking maybe around part 25 of maybe aging Aspen up into a teenager. I want to keep Avery as a teenager for a little bit longer, but I was thinking maybe part 25 or so we can go ahead and get Aspen aged up. Let me know how you guys feel about that if you would rather me wait a little longer. But to be fair, I think, you know, another four parts. I think that'd be more than enough time for her to kind of find her wings and get into the world of teenage dumb and i have kind of an idea of what i want her to be like as a teenager Ooh, this lady hold on i really really want us to be friends with this girl she's so cute go give her a cheerful introduction then you can finish the mural please 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 go introduce yourself to her because she's so adorable 
She's one of my favorite of the newer sims that come with don't please don't leave please yay okay I want to at least just meet her and then we can finish up that mural beautiful all right come back over here nobody better ruin my mural I'll hurt all of you go ahead and do that did you get some food little one you did good and you're sitting with a bunch of weirdos you know fair enough Oh, look how happy she looks. I'm so happy that they're happy. Oh, I guess all your friends left. Okay, thanks for that, I guess. Why don't you come over here and watch the living statue? And I think this is almost done. I really want to see what this is going to look like before I end the part. So I'm just going to speed it up. These take years to do, but they always look amazing. Oh, this lady's helping us. Oh, okay. We're actually almost done because she's helping us. Thank you somewhat, I guess. I really want us to do one of these in the house. I think that'd be cool. Is it done? Um, no, not yet. Okay. I thought it was done. I really want to see this. Come on, girls. I know it's getting kind of late. Oh, this looks awesome. Oh, so it actually tells you the art style. So it's an activist painting. Okay, that is really cool. So before this closes, do you want to come over here and order some food? Why don't you get a hamburger? What just popped up? Oh, Max is leaving. See you later, Maxie. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I am so excited that we made this move. Like I said, I know some of you guys are a little concerned about being in... The world of San Maishuno a little too much, but I, I will try my very, very best not to make it more of like a San Maishuno based type of series. But let's be real, guys. That apartment that we have now is so much nicer than the one that we had previously. So I'm extremely happy about that. So I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this part here. I really hope you guys all enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up. Leave your comments and suggestions down below. I did ask you guys a couple different questions. So first of all, let me know if you want me to decorate the apartment on camera or off camera. So definitely let me know how you guys feel about that. And then also let me know how you feel about if we were to age Aspen up around part 25 or so. So this is part 21. So we have another couple of parts until she gets aged up. We're going to throw her a huge birthday party, which is going to be so much fun. Also, if you're new, please don't forget to subscribe. It means so, so much to me. And I will speak to you all next time. Bye, guys.